Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Is my boobie popping out? I hope not. Today's video is going to be a Honey Bum try on haul. Honey Bum is like one of those really big Instagram brands that you kind of don't hear about day to day. You know what I mean? Kind of a bit of like a zaffle, like a wrong way, that kind of shop where there aren't any actual stores themselves and they're always known to be a little less unreliable. Therefore, I thought. Therefore I thought I'd test out a ton of their products today. I picked up things on their website that really intrigued me. I'll leave links to all of their stuff in the description box down below. As well as posting some outfits on 21 buttons, like kind of pre-styled, save you a job putting them together. But yeah, I'm actually really excited to try all of this on. I will have a discount code too, I think, and I'll leave that in the description box if you do want to get any of this stuff. I'm actually wearing something currently now, so I will show you what it is. I feel really weird today, I just feel like I can't film. <laughs> so this is the first thing that I got. It's this ruched kind of split just in your upper torso bit which I think is really flattering because that's where I have most muscle definition. I'm trying this on at the worst time in the day because I've literally eaten so much. So I'm going to look really bloated and I feel really bloated but that's okay. Everybody gets bloated. It's normal. I really like it. It's a really thick material so as you can see it isn't see through like literally my underwear that I'm wearing right now is black and you can't see it which is perfect it is so incredibly flattering on your figure it really shows off like my hourglass figure makes me feel like a sexy senorita <laughs> if i had a good bum literally i would wear this every day but i don't so <laughs> the next thing i'm gonna try on ooh, next thing i'm gonna try on are these now do these look familiar at all? Because I know they definitely look familiar to me. That was why I picked them up. These remind me so much of the IMG trousers. And bloody hell, they look tiny on the waist. Okay, they're elasticated. I'll just have to see. But literally, that is so minuscule. What? They're these red trousers. Really nice, thick material. And they've got mesh at the knees. They're elasticated at the bottom. And in the knees, they've got like a zip. So get some ventilation in the kneecaps because you all know how important that is. Hey, what the fuck? Oh my god. I'm gonna try those red bottoms on with this top here. I don't know this what? With this creamy white top here. I don't know if they'll necessarily go but I'm not really pairing outfits. Just trying to put everything in my body and show in my body on my body. Okay, the bottoms fit, but they are small. Like, they are very tight. And to be honest, I do think I could have done with sizing up. Which is weird because it said the model was small and, like, I looked similar to the model. I'm scared that they're giving me, like, a bit of a muffin top situ. The top is really cute. I can't figure out if it's see-through or not, but, yeah, it is cute for, like, summer. These trousers, I love okay so my old school bus just drove past my house and i am insecure because the windows open oh my god such a bloody mission to get on i, I don't know if this is even gonna go with my ankles that means i've got fat ankles honey bum's pricing is really Ow. affordable Ooh. don't know how i feel about these so these are like a gray hmm pair of i don't know what you call them joggers i guess what would you call these i have a pair of like black supreme ones which i wear all the time like they're really easy to just throw on and i thought i'd just get a pair of kind of like gray ones Ooh, i don't actually know how to feel about these they are too small like that is one thing they come up but on my ankles look how small they are i definitely have to size up if i wanted to get them again but i'm not 100 percent about the material i mean it's not bad but it's not as good as other ones i own but then again this these were literally so inexpensive compared to 150 pounds of my other joggers not joggers kind of joggers like shiny joggers <laughs> i don't know you have to make up your own mind i guess as to how you feel about these because these could be someone's cup of tea but i don't really think they're mine okay oh my god these are i'm not even kidding they're actually stuck onto my ankles oh uh, my god i can't get it off <laughs> I literally can't get it off. <laughs> oh my god. I'm like screaming and shouting and everyone is going to be able to hear me. Ow. I think I was being dramatic but it's genuinely stuck 
on my foot. Ow. Okay, so this is the next piece. I've had to put a bra on underneath it because otherwise my lips, my lips, my nips will literally poke through, but I wouldn't wear a bra with this like by choice. It's basically, let me see if I can. It's basically this like red bodysuit. I see these all over Instagram. I think the first person who made them big was Wolfie Cindy, who is just an angel from heaven. Oh, I'm trying to be, but that's never gonna happen. I would get nipple covers if I were to wear this out, but the quality of it feels lovely. It's like this at the back. Obviously you wouldn't have this like ugly bra strap there. I put on a new bra so that it would like try and give the whole effect, you know what I mean? Quality feels really nice. It's a really nice red material. It's got nice underwire so it'd be supportive on the tatters. It doesn't suffocate your lady region if you know what I mean which I know is a very common problem with bodysuits and I myself have been a victim. Girls supporting girls thank you. Okay wow I just realised like literally my whole bra was out that's not cute. I definitely wear this for like a night out with maybe a skirt or a pair of trousers if it's a cold evening and yeah I really like it I think it's really cute. I know this item is not going to be to everyone's taste but personally when I saw it I was like Yes. It's this snakeskin bodysuit. It actually has like thumb holes on the sleeves, which is like really IMG, -er, but I personally um like thumb holes remind me of being I had this weird obsession with thumb holes and arm warmers and leg warmers when I was probably about and I used to steal my sister's school socks and make them into arm warmers with little thumb holes and like it just reminds me of that and that's a time I don't really want to revisit in my life so I personally wouldn't wear it with the thumb holes but they're there if you do and I'm sure it looks really cool. It's super skin tight like form fitting. It's this really cool kind of like blue colour. I really like it. It gives me the like IMG -er vibes but obviously at a much more affordable price. I love the high neck of it. I think it's really 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 flattering. It's very garish but I feel like with the blue and the what color would you call this like the tan it's a little bit more wearable and it adds something like a little bit extra with I can see this with a pair of black flared jeans or just like a pair of black mum jeans and I think it would look so cool how noisy is my floor listen so annoying I just tried to get this bodysuit on and that honestly was no hope, which is weird considering it was a medium. These do not cover my boobs. They fall out. I don't even have big boobs, but they're falling out of this. Fashion doesn't always work, sweaty. So, um, this is the last item. It's this like velour jumpsuit, which I thought it was a tracksuit, but it's not. It's definitely a jumpsuit. And that is so my fault. That is not like on the website, but I thought, okay, it means I don't have to wear the velour on velour because that's a bit intimidating, but I love the whole like juicy couture, like tracksuit vibe sort of thing. I thought I could like, thought I could do like a bit of an off the shoulder thing with the tracksuit and it would look kind of cute but it's not it's a jumpsuit and when I first tried it on I was like you know what no this is okay like lounge around the house airport outfit and then my sister disagreed and then my mum was like oh my god no I love it I think it looks really cool and like really Kardashian I'm still undecided I don't know if I'd be ballsy enough to like wear this as a proper outfit going somewhere I'd wear it to like if my mum wanted me to come on a food shop with her or something like that but I'm not 100% sure, so please boost my ego and tell me it looks good, even if you think it doesn't. So that is the end of my Honey Bum haul. I really, really, really hope you all enjoyed it. Don't forget that I have all the links to all the clothes and everything, as well as a discount code that you can use. I'm not being sponsored. I'm not earning anything through this discount code. Yes, Honey Bum did send me these clothes. However, as you can tell, all my opinions are completely 100% honest. As always, I'm never going to work with a company that I don't like. And when I work with companies, I always give you my honest opinions and yay for honesty if you did enjoy the video please give it a huge thumbs up i'm really doing i'm really enjoying doing hauls recently and i hope you're all enjoying watching them if you would like to see more of me don't forget to click the subscribe button and also click the little bell so that you can see my videos in your subscription box don't forget to leave me requests and comments in the comment section down below and you can also check out my social medias i have them all listed in the description box i'm most active on my instagram and my twitter i'm losing my voice oh my goodness and yeah that is pretty much much everything i love you all so 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 much 
and I will see you all very, very, I really hope I don't have lipstick on my teeth, very, very soon. Bye.